Let me guess, you are looking into getting a Whippet. It's great that you're doing research in advance, but will a Velcro dog be a good fit for you? Yeah, Whippets are notorious for being Velcro dogs. What is a Velcro dog, you ask? Let me show you. Before we continue, if you're new here, I'm Adi and I've had Whippets for 15 years. I'm currently owned by 8 of them and I make breed specific videos to help existing and future Whippet owners. If that's your type of content or you want to learn more about the breed, subscribe and join our growing Whippet family. Let's say you like Whippets, their gentle and cuddly nature, their graceful appearance and their loving temperament. Me too. And what about the idea of a dog that is stuck to you 24-7? Your personal space is a fading memory of the past, now replaced by a pair of sad eyes every time you're about to leave the house without them. If you hate the idea, swipe left. The Whippet is not for you, super glue runs in your veins and you can't change that. If you like that, that's lovely, but I also hope you have an action plan for preventing and dealing with separation anxiety, which they are very much prone to. Let me give you an example of a Velcro dog. That's our youngest Whippet Eris, and unlike the rest of our pack that's more stuck to my mom, Eris is stuck to me, all day, every day. She's very interested in where I've been, where I'm going, can she join? She joins anyway. She goes to bed with me and once I get up in the morning, she gets up too. She spends a lot of time in my room while I'm working. If I leave the room, she comes with. But since she was a tiny puppy, I demand that she finds an alternative hobby. I wanted to set healthy boundaries to avoid separation anxiety. And I never wanted her to be obsessed with being my shadow. So sometimes she leaves my room without me and she comes to my desk to let me know she wants out. Then we negotiate that I can't go with her because I have to earn money for her spoiled life. This is what it looks like. Hi, Didi. 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 Other times she's just busy with different tasks, like having fun for example, and I very much encourage this. If she hasn't seen me for an hour, she acts like she hasn't seen me for days, while I haven't even left the house. Speaking of leaving the house, she knows very well when I'll take her with me and when she gets to stay home, based on the clothes I'm wearing and the bag I'm packing. Gym clothes and gym bag mean no chance. Regular clothes mean maybe, but the outcome depends on the jacket. And if I reach for my treats bag, she knows her trip to the outside is booked. She looks very disappointed when she knows she can't join, but she gets over it. There is no whining, nervousness or anxiety. Would she prefer I don't go anywhere, or if I do, I take her with me every time? 
Of course, but if I don't, it's not a problem, as long as I come back, and I always do. If you want a whippet, having a Velcro dog will be your new reality. Take it or leave it, but before you get the dog. And also, if you get the whippet and you hope to beat the fridge to their magnet, but they choose to get stuck to your partner or another family member instead, please don't cry. They still love you, trust me. It's just that the absence of someone else is more dramatic. I hope you enjoyed this short video, have a lovely rest of your week, and I will see you very soon with another one. Bye-bye!